welcome back to my channel. We're just at Costco checking out all the outdoor stuff, including the barbecues and camping gear. So I thought I'd take you along and show you what they have. So come and join me. Bestway queen size air bed with, mat with pump is in store right now. So these are $80. They are 17 inches high or 43 centimeters. And then they're 2.03 meters in length by 1.52 meters in width by uh, 43 centimeters in height. Or they're 80 inches by 60 inches by 17 inches. So these ones are really nice because they have the pump included. And we've actually had one of these in the past and they work really well. Um, and it's easier, right? Because if like it kind of flattens over a little bit or something, you can just pump plug it in and pump it up. You don't have to like get out a pump and hook it up and all that stuff. It's just right there. And I think, yeah, it looks like it was like our old one where the um, connection is just hidden in there and it does come with a travel bag. So these ones um, would be really great if you're going camping, especially with the uh, long weekend before school starts coming up. I know a lot of people go camping and we're going into spring. So that's when a ton of people will start going uh, camping here as well. So these are 80. Then they also have, they've got lots of stuff in here. So this is a My Coolman car cooler. It's a 9.5 liter thermoelectric warm and cold. So this has built-in cup holders, uh, USB sockets and storage. <clears throat> Let's just look at the box here. So it's super compact, fits in any vehicle, USB socket, built-in storage for leads, keeps your drinks cool and keeps your snacks warm. So you can see here, so that's really handy if you're gonna go kind of like on a long trip. And it's got a little spot there. Does that pop up? Yeah, it pops up. That's it. That's pretty cool. And you can choose whether it's on hot or cold. And yeah, 9.5 liters for the 84. And they've got a bigger version of it. This one is right here. So this is the My Coolman single zone compressor, 47 liter portable cooler. So this one is 700. So you can see it here. It is, it's battery protected, multifunctional lid, digital display. It's got an AC and a DC output. So you can plug it into your car or into a PowerPoint. Internal light, upright storage, and nationwide support. So this one is a fridge freezer. I don't think it has the ability for hot and cold. Yeah, so this one's just for cool. So you can see all the temperature in here. Can I pop it open? Yeah. And you can see inside it's got a basket and everything. So that's for 700 So the Titan Rolling Cooler with Cart, this is a 60 can cart. It holds, um, it says 5 plus 10 cans and plus ice. So it says keeps ice up to our cold, it keeps ice up to three days, so it'll keep them cool. And this is 70. It says high performance insulation. It says leak proof, easy clean liner, water and stain resistant exterior and insulated front compartment. So it's got like, looks like, oh yeah, it all pops up. So it all folds down and it can pop up and it has cup holders. You've got all kinds of different compartments. Let's see here, so it's easy access lid, ultra safe, leak proof, easy clean lining, insulated, two drink holders, and it says adjustable back saver shoulder strap with anti-slip shoulder pad. And that's pretty neat. And that's what it'll look like when it's all hooked up, and that's for 70. Then they've got the Lightspeed Outdoors Ultimate Backpack Totes. These are $24.97, so these ones are being discontinued. These are like a version of almost like a smaller version of the Costco cooler bag, but then it actually becomes a backpack, which is pretty cool. So it's got 24 liter capacity. It's water resistant fabric cleans easily and resists staining. The zippered lower mesh compartment provides added storage, air circulation and releases sand. Oh, that's really good. Uh, dual design can be carried as a tote or a backpack. Sorry, it's really windy here. And outer straps hold towels, blankets and mats. So there you can see someone's kind of carrying. Oh, and they've got a little compartment. Yeah, in the bottom there. So they've got showing her like shoes are in there. So that's pretty neat. That would be great for the beach. And you can kind of put things in the sides and stuff, it says. And that's for 25. There's the Contigo Auto Spout Jugs. These are two packs for 37. So it looks like they've got, I think something's happened. I don't think there's supposed to be two red ones in this one. Yeah, <laughs> I think that was probably the display. Uh, it looks like they only come with the red and the blue. So they've got the flip top here. Let's see how that goes. Oh yeah, you auto release, so you press that. So that's handy. They hold up to, let's see. So 1.9 liters or 64 fluid ounces. And these are leak proof and it's a two, 
uh, two sports jug packs. You get the red and the blue, and then they hold up to 10 hours cold BPA free. So those are pretty handy, and they have a nice little carrying handle. It's rubber, so it wouldn't slip in your hands. And then they've got the Hoda Kraken rechargeable flashlight. This is 4,000 lumens. This one is 55. So this would be good if you're gonna go camping. So this is a tactical rechargeable flashlight. It has three modes. And you can see here for flood, it's a three meter or 9.8 foot, um, like a light space or whatever. The focus is 1.5 meters or 4.9 feet. This is made with aerospace aluminum. They said there was three modes, but it doesn't talk about the third one. Um, and it is a rechargeable device. You can see all the information there. And it's got the charger included for the 55. You can also get a pack of the Duracell flashlights. These are in three plats. They're only 550 lumens. So these are a variable focus flashlight. Uh, you can just by twisting it, it'll narrow or widen the beam. And it already comes with the batteries you need for each of them. And that's for 33. Then they've got some hammocks. So they've actually set it up there, so you can see it comes on the stand. These are an eight foot cotton double hammock bundle. So it's a bundle because it comes with uh, the carrying case, the stand, as well as the fabric. Um, and I don't know if our, yeah, it looks like all of them are just this one design here. So it says the dimensions, it holds up to 204 kilos and I'll put on the screen how much that is in pounds. And then um, it's 1.79 me yeah, meters by 1.19 meters by 1.09 meters. So it's quite large. Um, so it's quite a big hammock and that's for 189.99. Then there's the Cascade Mountain Sleeping Pad and Pillow for 60. So you can see them here. And this is, this accessory's not included. It's got for three seasons, but it's not for winter. And let's see what it says on the back here. Oh, here we go. Here's the dimensions. So it comes with, this is a 74 inch pad or 188 centimeter by uh, 58.5 or 23 inches. And then you've got a bag for it as well as a bag for the pillow. And the pillow is 12 inches by 15.3 inches or 30.5 centimeters by 39 centimeters. And it says it includes a pad with a uh, stuff sack, pillow with a stuff sack, adhesive repair tape for quick and easy repairs on the go. So that's really handy when they um, include those. You get like a little repair kit inside. And then there's the carbon fiber trekking pole. These are a manager special, so they're $29.98. And this is now with improved cork grip. So these are good for hiking. It says carbon fiber quick lock trekking pole. It says reduces impact on knees and back, enhances upper body toning and increases balance. So it's got a height adjustable. And it's good for, it's got the different uh, pieces for snow, hard surface, sand and mud and protecting surfaces. It says cork grip is light and comfortable and non-slip. Grip extends, extensions allow a variety of hand positions. Carbon fiber shafts are extendable, ultralight and rugged. So they only weigh for 40 or 445 grams without tips or ba baskets it says and then it, or it's five point or 15.69 ounces adjustable from 26 inches to 54 inches or 66.04 centimeters to 137.16 centimeters and here they have some stuff to take with you when you're camping so this is the Shakespeare ugly stick balance combo it's a 662 meter fishing rod so I've seen this in store for a little while now, uh, especially because we're getting closer to spring. So let's see if I can pull it up here. So this is a spinning combo, uh, six, point si or six foot six inch line class, five, uh, 3.5, five, three to five kilos, uh, action medium, and it's a two piece set. Can I see the back? There we go, and you can kind of see, it doesn't really show what it's set up, but it's made with graphite and fiberglass, it's ugly turf guides are with aluminum oxide inserts and the clear tip is solid fiberglass. So that'll make sense to people who fish because I don't <laughs> and it's $75.
There's also the Timber Ridge lounge chairs. So these are $100 and they're really large. Like I think they would even be probably taller than me when I'm stand or sitting in them. They're a compact folding design, fold out table with cup holder slots on the side there. And you can see there's a cup holder. They've got the pillow at the top and an adjustable headrest and they hold up to 136 kilos or 300 pounds. And actually that's, oh yeah, it's padded all the way down. That's really nice. Cause that's even just on the footrest. And it looks like they only come in the blue here at our Costco. And then this Cascade low profile uh, chair with carrying bag has been discounted again. So I think it was like 30 something last week and now it's uh, 29.96. So they're trying to get rid of these. So these are like the really short little beach chairs. Um, it was originally $55 and they've got lots here, like you can see. So it says here, it says they're comfortable with breathable mesh fabric and cushion armrests. They've got folds up fast and stows easily. So it's 66 centimeters by 17.7 centimeters or 26 inches by seven inches when it's folded. It's got a handy shoulder or sorry, handy storage bag with shoulder strap included and it's strong steel and aluminum frame holds up to 113.3 kilos or 250 pounds. So those would be really good for the beach. Like I could see those drying really easily and everything and then be easy if you're like camping and you don't want to carry the bigger, heavier ones with you to your campsite. And then they have the Max Sports Outdoor Bench. It's a five seat. So you can see that each one has a cup holder. That's actually really smart. I thought that was a bed first. And then they've got like a little mesh bag at the end. So this is 60. So it says five people seat. So strong steel frame, uh, deluxe polyester fabric and mesh design. It's got five drink holders, two large side pouches and carrying bag included. So it comes in the carrying bag here for the 60. Then there's the Coleman swing wall canopy. This is 200. It's three meters by three meters. So that's nine feet by nine feet. So it holds up or up to 160 square feet or 14.86 square meters covered shade. It's three steps to step, or sorry, three steps to set up within three minutes. It's a swing wall as an awning or a wall and made from heavy duty UV guard. So you can see here, it's like really, really big. They used to have it actually set up, I'm pretty sure, over all like the barbecue stuff, um, but they don't have it set up anymore. 60 square, extra square feet of shade with a uh, wall fully extended. So this must be the wall that pops down. There's also the um, Oz Trail, it says 450 Tour. It's a 10 person tent. This is a clearance item. It's for 300, so 20, or sorry, 299.97. So this is it right here. They don't have this one set up but it's a spacious 10 person tent, innovative integrated steel frame for super quick pitching. This heavy duty rip stop, uh, it says 150D fly and 150D inner. And the dimensions are 450, let's see if I can find all of them here. Yeah, so this is, that's packaging. So the dimensions are 450, centimeters by 350 centimeter or sorry the dimensions are 450 centimeters by 300 centimeters and the awning is 195 centimeters um, and then it comes in the carrying bag and everything here so you can kind of carry and it shows how you would set up for 10 people so you'd have to be nice and cozy with each other and it's got a little awning on the front and then for 200 and this one is a clearance item and this one's set up up top so I'll just tell you about it and then I'll show you this is the Camp Valley Core six person tent with full uh, rain fly. This is uh, $199.97. It's a six person block out tent. So you can see here it kind of comes on an angle. It's three meters by 2.7 meters by 1.6 meters or 10 feet by nine feet by 5.5 feet. So it sleeps six people, fits two queen size air beds, uh, tall center height, which is um, 1.6 meters or 66 inches. And it's water resistant floor and rain flies. This accessory is not included. That's what it looks like without the blackout and that's with the blackout technology. So I'll just show you what it looks like assembled. I'll just have to walk around again. So that's it assembled. It's quite large in there. And then you can see that kind of pops out and it's got the flaps over the windows and stuff. Uh, Kingsford Professional Briquettes. So it's a 5.4 kilo bag or 12 pounds. So they've just got, this is hottest burning professional charcoal briquettes. 
and it has it's about three uses in the bag for the $19 then they've got the X light flexible gas lighters these are a five pack we have like the big ones and these things are so handy uh, <clears throat> So it just says five refillable flexi gas lighters for $10. It says they're ideal for lighting charcoal barbecues and grills, fireplaces and campfires, stove, furnace, or water heater pilot lights. Then there's the Next Grill 19 inch tabletop grill. This is cast aluminum. So it says a Fortress 2.0 is what it's called. Let's see, it's all. It's all cast right in there and it looks like it has a grill plate, like a, a grill plate and then like the, yeah, so you got a flat one as well. And you've got two burners, yeah, two burner cast iron tabletop and this one is 220. The next grill, KitchenAid four burner grill with side burner, so this is 860. Uh, this has even heat technology, it's a 304. Uh, steel or stainless steel lid with cast uh, or cast aluminum sides and a cast iron cooking plate So I love the fact that a lot of the grills now so this is very dark come with the flat griddle So you could do like totally do breakfast outside especially when it gets really hot I mean you don't want to be heating up your house if you're paying for air conditioning with your oven um, They've got a grill or a burner on the side And doesn't want to close now <laughs> And there's your starter for that one and then they've got four burners there. Oh, I like the fact that they've got, you can hang things there. You can put your tank and everything underneath and it looks like it comes with a cover, yeah. Cover included. So that's what it looks like here. Then they've got the Weber Spirit uh, E210 LP with roasting pack and cover. So this is a smaller one. It's an LPG fuel type. It's porcelain enameled. Includes two stainless steel burners. So again, they've got the flat griddle. And then the grill itself, it's got two side things there. You've got your starter, your grill pack. It looks like you could only put your um, tank underneath. And then this one comes with a crossover ignition system, fixed commercial grade thermometer, which you have here, and roasting pack. It doesn't show the roasting pack. So I guess, oh, it must be this. So you, it's an extra flat plate. And then there's another one with smaller holes in it. And does it come with, yeah, and cover. And then they also have another Weber, sorry, that one was 660. And then this one is the E Spirit, or sorry, the Spirit E310 Premium with cover. So this one is LPG fuel as well. It's bigger, you can see, because it's got the three burners. Um, it's a crossover ignition system, fixed commercial grade, and it comes with the roasting pack as well. So they don't have it in here, but it has the flat plate and the, um, the one with the smaller kind of openings in it and a cover as well for the uh, 860. And then they have this massive outdoor kitchen, which is like a dream. I mean, after we were doing a bunch of concrete around our house, this would be amazing. Like it's got, you've got stone countertops or quartz, you've got an outdoor kitchen, you have all this storage, you could totally buy, I mean, if you have money for this, you could totally afford to buy uh, a fridge. Oh, it does come with a fridge, oh, holy cow. Um, and it doesn't have, oh, here we go. So this is the Gasmate Entertainer 304 Stainless Steel Kitchen. So I mean, they've got it set up in L, but you could do it in any kind of shape you want it. It's even got a bottle opener, like my goodness. It does come with the fridge and each count, like each area has a countertop. So it's LPG six burner and a side burner, which is right behind the sign. Is that a, yeah, it's just one, oh, it's one big burner. And it says total heat, oh, it comes side burner and rotisserie burner on what it comes with the rotisserie pack. Uh, the total heat output is 91,000 BTUs and it's got a stainless steel fridge with granite tops. So it's all granite. That's what all that kind of sparkly stone is. And two door storage module, sink, bin and storage module is the whole thing. So yeah, you've got for your bottles, you've got all kinds of storage, you've got drawers. Like this thing's amazing. This would look so nice outside someone's house but I would think because it is stainless steel you need to have it under cover because this would probably rust on you and it's got the thermometer I don't know how accurate that would be with such a big um, big barbecue but this thing's pretty awesome for 5,000 and it's on manager special in 98 <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Costco now has a smoker in store. So this is a Louisiana, Louisiana Grills wood pellet vertical smoker. So it's quite tall, like it comes up to almost my shoulders. So it says it's a wood pellet vertical smoker. It's got, it does 12 whole chicken roasts, uh, 18 racks of ribs or 10 pork shoulders. And you can see here, it's kind of more information. It's uh, it holds 27.2 kilos or 59.9 pounds of the pellet hopper. It goes smokes up to 35 hours and easy touch and ignite igniter. It says meat probes included and has six removable cooking racks and grill cover included. So that's pretty awesome. That's one of the nice things about buying stuff from Costco is that it always comes with a bunch of extra stuff, <laughs> which is really handy. There's Louisiana Grills barbecue uh, hardwood pellets. This is 18 kilos or 40 pounds. And does it say, the other one says how many this does. It just says competition blend. So this would be what you'd use in that smoker. And this is for 44. Then they've got a smaller KitchenAid grill here. So this is the Next Grill KitchenAid two burner gas grill and it's 500. So it's just a smaller one. It's got that grill plate, but it's not, is it reversible? I don't think it's reversible, but it's got the two and then it's got sides that pop up. So you can see what it is fully extended. It does come with a cover. It says distributes consistent heat across the entire grill surface and reduces flare ups. It's got foldable side shelves and cast iron cooking plate. So this would be really handy on like a balcony, like if you didn't have a large outdoor area. And this is for 500 with the cover. And then for 200, there's the Napoleon 22 inch charcoal kettle grill. This one is stainless steel cooking grid. It's got stainless steel heat diffuser, cold touch handle, removable heavy steel ash catcher, and a rugged out, uh, weatherproof wheels. And it's got a temperature gauge on it. So you've got that. I'm just gonna pull it up a little bit because it's obviously not connected. And it looks like it comes with a cover. Doesn't say that up there, but I think it does because it's inside. And that was 200. And then for 350, you get the smoke hollow charcoal grill. This one is a cast iron cooking grate. It's got adjustable easy lift charcoal grill. You can see all the different requirements. I don't know, like I know pretty much nothing about smokers and charcoal grills, <laughs> just the gas grills, um, and that's just from use. So it's got a lever there. Yeah, folding side shelves. Uh, a cast iron front door and then it's got adjustable easy up charcoal gr grates which I think is that and it looks like it comes with a cover for the 350. Then there's also the Louisiana Grills Ceramic um, Camado. Camo, Camado. I'm not, I'm not sure how to say that. Grill. This is for 950. I actually saw someone just buy one. They said the packaging is like really really heavy. It um, includes ceramic heat deflector. It has a 0.42 square meter cooking surface, uh, adjustable top and bottom dampeners. It reminds me of the egg, I think is what they call it, the one that's in, at least in Canada, it's called like the big green egg or something. Um, <clears throat> so I think this closes, yeah, and it looks kind of like an egg. And then it's got spring assisted soft hinges and magnetic closing, fold down plastic side shelves, so those pop down. Uh, and cover included, so it comes with a cover. That's here, you get custom fit. It's a five in one smoke, bake, sear, roast, and char grill. You can see all kind of the information and everything they have for it, so that's pretty cool. And that was for 950. And then they have the Louisiana Grills. We'll come back to that one so I can show you the sign. Louisiana Grills Series 900 wood pedal or pellet grill. So this is a push button igniter with easy start for a thousand. It's got a digital control center. It's a 6.35 kilo hopper capacity for wood pellet fuel, programmable meat probe for precision cook or precise cooking and weatherproof grill cover included. So, so 6.4 grand or four kilos or says 14.1 pounds of pellet you can hold inside of it. And you've got the temperature thermometer oh that's a really heavy lid like that would be a really good seal and then I like the fact that it has the stand in the front 
I'd love to be able to smoke my own meat and make like bacon and stuff, but I find this very intimidating. Leave a comment down below if you have a smoker and if you love it and tell me the reason why you love it.